right, hello, and welcome to WBPL 76. Hope you guys are doing well out there. Everybody's been donating to the Goob Challenge. Well, tonight we're going to play some more Tomb Raider 2. Uh, I've been a little bit busy with projects and things, so I haven't been able to stream much of it, but... We're here today, and I'm just going to name some people, Mercury, Alpha X, Mad Hatter, 0307, Black Fire Gaming 101, Silicon Soul, Bren Wolf, and of me, uh, courtesy Flush, also donated to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge, which is awesome, because this is going to be really cool when that stream happens. Let me bring the camera up. Hello! Welcome! And so now we're going to play a game that's going to take place in Tibet. When I was a kid, I didn't know this was Tibet. I thought it was Antarctica because I didn't know Tibet was cold until I played the, until I read about where this game took place and the behind the scenes and stuff. And I was like, oh, this makes a lot more sense now. Because uh, I was like, why were you in Antarctica? But we do, I believe we go there in Tomb Raider 3 or 4. As well as Confessions of a Ladder Maker has contributed uh, 62,000 to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. So let me go ahead and load this game up. And hopefully it doesn't explode. I hope you guys are doing well today as well. Um, here we go. This very busy Thursday. Oh, we have an update. What's the patch? What did we pa Oh. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bring the screen over so you guys can see what I'm seeing because it's... Uh, yeah, yeah you, you'll see what I mean. And UNC Samurai has contributed 70,000 goob to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge, as well as Digiman619, the Anti Digs, and Fan Art Fantast, as well, to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. But also, take a look at this. I don't know what this update is. Look, what is it? What are we doing? What's going on here? What is the. You do enjoy Trick City? Very cool. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. I, I, uh, boy, what? Updated spiderweb textures in HD mode. Laura properly now grabs ledges and when running off and holding the grab buttons. Oh, I didn't realize that was not happening. <laughs> uh, music tracks. Resolved small gaps. Lights in HD of the rec now flicker correctly. Oh. They fixed all kinds of stuff, and we're... All right, we're... See, we're playing a game that's a remaster in progress, it seems. As well, Quenchel66 uh, has donated Meepinix as well, and Digi to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. All right, let me load this up. Now that we're done ogling whatever this is supposed... Oh, new leopard skin outfit. How are we supposed to get there? How, what are we improved? Epic uh, now launches with a full screen. Laura, no, all games. But where do you get the cool? I want that outfit. Where do you get? How do you get it? Doesn't say. Special outfit for Nightmare in Vegas added. I okay. I, I'm not gonna worry about it. We're just gonna play the game. <laughs> this is what this is what happens when you pay too much uh, attention to the, this dumb stuff. I don't think I could pull off that outfit, says... Uh, I agree, I don't think I can either, so don't feel bad. Try. <laughs> Tomb Raider 2. Taking place today... Oh yeah, it even says it. If I read this, the save games when I was a kid, I probably might have knew what I was looking at. So the Tibetan foothills. And my controller has disconnected. Hold on, it's reconnecting. That's what that cutting out was. Apparently, my controller making the game freak out. Very, like, that is, inc like, this is, um, I, I'm not going to say it's brave, but it's incredibly uh, ballsy to be walking around in a mountainous region with just jungle shorts and a bomber jacket. But she doesn't mind. It was the 90s. It was a different era. People could do this. We've lost that ability as a people. And I don't think that's really too bad of a loss. It just We just lost it. I'm going to drop down here, and then I'm going to try to grab the ledge as I slide. Like that. Because I saw that there's a little... Can I... Okay. 
Yeah, I saw this when we were last playing. I didn't get a chance to go in here, I don't think. And I'm just walking for my own safety because I've already slid into many things today. And my feet are fine now, but boy, do they hurt when I uh, fell. Oh. Is that like a wall that I can climb? I don't... Oh my god! Oh my god, it scared me. I wasn't expecting this. Oh yeah, I'm fine. It's only half my health. Fucking hell, dude. The bet doesn't... It's no joke. Ashura86 has contributed 24,000 total to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. Listen, I respect the jacket, keep warm, but you should probably wear pants in the Sub-Zero cold. But I'm about to go into the water. Why would you wear pants in the water? Actually, I would not want to get in this water. This water looks freezing. And hey, King Kia 23 welcome to WPPL 76. As we get lost in the Tibetan foothills in Tomb Raider 2. This is also uh, a remaster. Uh, so this is the original game. And then you can press a button and switch between the two. And see what they did differently. There's an area down there. And there's also an area up here. Oh, there's a dog. Right there. And is that a jet ski? <laughs> Ow, that was smart. Oh, I came from there. Okay. Maybe your legs were so cold she got the leopard's print outfit. Oh, yeah. Maybe that would be... Yeah. Well, how do you... Where do you get it? You know, that's the question. Is it... Uh, what do I have in my inventory? I have the Seraph. I don't think that does anything, though. Controls, maybe. Sensitivity. No, no. Oh, maybe it's the... Right button. And then outfit. Okay. Bomber ba bathrobe? Why? Why would I want to wear a bathrobe in... No. Okay, that's pants, but the top is still too little. This looks like a desert outfit. Nevada Pacific. Yeah, that's too little. A cat suit? I think that would be even worse. There's no layers between you. Antarctica. Now, this looks more like it. This looks more like what it should be. This is what... I guess she didn't really have a change of pants on that plane, though. Bloody? Interesting. <gasps> That's what... It's uh, Vegas? What? Where's Vegas? I've never played a Vegas Tomb Raider. What the... F yeah, let's go to Vegas. Oh, they won't let me keep it. Ah. <laughs> All right, I don't know what's down here. We're going to find out together. Oh, cool. A, a cave full of spikes and stuff. I don't want to die. It's okay. It's just freezing. I'm just looking around, just making sure I'm not getting... Okay, we are on the other side of the mountain now. This is probably the point where I should save my game. Because we have just traversed quite a bit here. We'll make a new save game. This game is unplayable. This isn't without the iconic wedge. What wedge are you talking about? You talking about those pants? I think that if anything, they made it more pop out. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. 
Oh, you mean though? Oh, yeah, this outfit probably doesn't show. I know what you mean, yeah. I remember back in the day, I read a PC Gamer article where they said, like... Uh-oh. Well, hold that thought. No, bird, no! Sorry. Uh, so anyway, I, I read a PC Gamer article back when this was, like, new. Um, and I believe the way it was described was... At some point in the future, this is me paraphrasing, Laura Croft is probably going to need a shopping cart for her assets uh, to with a rocket launcher attached if they keep going with the series. And you got a water break from me? Thank you, Vomata. I haven't drank water all day today. <laughs> I'm kidding. Thank you. And Mer Emperor has contributed 20,000 total to the April Art Goop Drive Challenge as well. Is Digiman uh, wants me to stretch? I have done many stretches today. Ugh. Many. Um, hey, Kitty Low also donated 5,320 to the April Art Goop Drive Challenge. Thank you very much. The art that is going to come from that will certainly be awesome. I just... I just feel like I've, I've made a mistake somewhere. I don't know how. I don't know why or where. I just feel like there's a mistake. And I made it. I don't think I could make that jump. As a matter of fact, I think that hill is actually steep. Actually, let me let's do this. We can do this in the new version, the remaster. Oh god, okay. Maybe if I jump from over here to over here, and then I can climb up this snow bank and then get up to the top there. Yeah, that's probably the move, but we'll we saved it, so what we'll do is we'll try jumping from here. We'll see what happens. I think it's too far. It is. Yeah, it's too far. She at some point she stops trying to grab the air. And just like free falls. So I just need to jump over there. I think. Most of this game is just guesswork. Actually, I can just jump over this hump, right? I don't know. Doesn't look like it. Yeah, I need more space to jump. Maybe if I do... I might be trying something that's not necessary, but let's see. Yeah, no, there's no, there's no getting around that hump like that. It's uh, that's brought up there that high on purpose. Somebody didn't want me to do what I was trying to do. How dare they? And I'm gonna try this anyway. Yeah, that works. Awesome. And there's a health pack over there, which is gonna be super useful for. Well, damn near everything so far. Crow, just uh, <laughs> look, and he originally fucked up on her model, so her chest was like a singular polygon, and it wasn't even remotely the shape of a human chest. Oh, right. It's been a meme ever since, huh? I didn't know that. I played the original, but I don't recall that. Oh, uh, uh-oh. Is he doing the thing where he's just floating straight downwards? <sighs> this what is kind of bird is this? It just floats. It's a hover bird. Uh -huh. Health pack, yes. It's clearly a tank. All right, now we go up here. Not bad at all. Yeah, the bird just descended slowly downwards into like a vertical plane and just kept coming down. I'm like, what? <laughs> just breaking the laws of physics up there. Oh shit, this guy's got a gun. Let's see, we need gun as well. Let's do M16.
All right. We, we got them wrecked. Who are these guys? At least they wore some clothes that are meant for this area. That guy's got a machine gun of some sort, and this guy has that. What is this? That is a gun-shaped object. Oh. Yeah, that's, um... That's unfortunate, but, you know, what did it look like originally? Oh, right, he has the he has a laser sight from Terminator 2. Or Terminator 1, I should say. Interesting. To bit and, uh -huh. uh, to, oh, yeah, to bit and ho hover tank. Highly endangered, you monster. I didn't want to kill any birds. If I don't, uh -huh. they just fly into me until I die. <laughs> they don't, there's nothing I can do about it. I'm going to go for this thing in a minute, but i got to check the area first before I go crazy. I can't use that on the door. I mean, I could. It just wouldn't work. Some stuff there. Can we get in through the roof? Well, I can climb on the roof. Hmm. I perhaps need a key that I do not possess yet. But one that I can obtain with... Uh, oh, there's a little doggo up here. I remember now. Uh -huh. There we go. We saw that earlier. Just wanted to make sure we picked it up. And I'm assuming this door is connected to some sort of mechanism in the house. Let's take a look. Can we see in the window? There's definitely a lever in there. I'm assuming that's what that's for. Let's go find out. Let's get on the hover... Hu the, no, not gun. Bike. Oh, yeah, here we go. Hover... <laughs> jet Ski Adventure. I don't like keep calling it Hovercraft. Jet Ski Adventure here on WBPL 76. What's this guy doing? He's dead now. Jet Ski Adventure. It's not Jet Ski. This is a Snow Ski. Uh, snowmobile. Snowmobile Adventure. Jet Ski Snowmobile. I'm going to go fast. Can't go that way, I'll just get trapped. Yeah! Oh yeah, you guys thought we weren't gonna get away with so- Oh no! Okay, well we gotta try it again. Oh, is that- I can hit the action button to go faster. <laughs> you guys like my aerial drifts? Woo! As a kid, I would have absolutely loved to have had a snow ski. Snow, snotmobile, snowmobile. Yeah! Okay, don't fall off the edge. Oh! Oh no! No, 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 no! Ah, oh, we were so close. Hold on, I gotta do the thing in Austin Powers. There we go. Alright, there we go. Woo! <laughs> I love it. I love it. It's my favorite thing now. Yeah! Oh! What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> no! We were so... We didn't even save! Oh my god! I'm the worst! Oh, 
there we go. There we go. Uh, the bird is above me now. And I can't see it because it is literally flying straight down like a kite that's falling out of the sky. Okay. Now that we've eliminated a, an endangered species, Jesus. Hello, hey Aiden. Uh huh. Yeah, we got to the point where I am um currently wearing a blanket on my legs. Actually, I, I you're probably wondering why I put blanket mode. Well, it's cold for some reason. I might be. I might be get coming down with something, but let me show you what I mean. I'll bring it up over here. So I um I have I have a blanket that's pretty uh dumb. I got a, a pink blanket that's camouflage. I'm trying to find it here. The words, yes. And it's from a time long ago in a galaxy far, far away. When things like this existed. Yes, this is a blanket I have wrapped around my legs right now. And I, uh, Laser Ivan has contributed 10,000 total goob to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. But yeah. I just wanted to show that. It's weird, right? <laughs> As well, Aiden has contributed 36,000 total to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. Nermetia49 has contributed 29,895 total to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. Nice. Okay, we'll just do this. I didn't want to do this, but she's doing this. Yeah, the second she stops, they pop in. That's cool. All right, let's see. M16 time. Got him. All right, we'll make sure we save before we get on the bike again and blow up. Uh -huh. That was um, unexpected, let's just say. Uh -huh. I'm also going to adjust something with the audio, if it'll let me. I don't think it will, actually. No. Oh, no, here it is. Sound. Yeah, let's bring the, let's bring the, the music up more. I like I like hearing the sound. The atmosphere sounds way cool. Other than just like the the quiet and then the shooting. It takes about 30 bullets for each kill. It does. Uh -huh. It's a lot of bullets for just M16. All right. The fuck out of my way. I'm Lara Croft. Woo. Oh, oh, oh no. <laughs> I couldn't grind. I couldn't grind. <laughs> I, was I was trying to grind on the ledge. <laughs> All right, sorry, sorry. I hope I'm not being too loud. All right, I'll get that guy later. For now, we must we must drive. Yeah. Hmm. 
No, hold on. How do you... How do you get off? How do you get off? How do I get off the bike? Select. Start. No. Woo! Oh. <laughs> ah. I'm not going to explode again. Don't worry. This is how you ride a snowmobile. See, I'm not worried about it. Maybe I have to be on flat ground? That doesn't make sense. No, no what? No. no what? What are you talking about? I just went off the snowmobile. All right. I tried pressing as many different combinations of buttons, but I could not get off the snowmobile. I tried the jump button. She doesn't do anything. A lizard with daft ideas has contributed 44,000 to the total to the April Art Goo Drive Challenge. Oh, God. Thank you very much, Liz. Ah, ah! Oh no, I gotta do it all again. All right, so. Ow. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay, we're okay, we're okay. It's just going in. It's going in reverse. It just means that the. It just means the reverse works. So I'm good at this. Yeah. See, that was important. I did that on purpose. There we go. Nobody gets off Mr. Bones' wild ride. Even the cool music has stopped. It's like, dude, come on. <laughs> I'm sorry, composer. My my ability to drive a snowmobile is not that great. I have to jump over those blocks. We hit that before and we died. So how do we get off the bike? What do we? Oh, God. I promise you. This is the correct and professional way to play Tomb Raider 2. You might be thinking to yourself, wow, this seems like kind of pointless, and I don't know, maybe you're not that good at it. But you see, that's because you're untrained. You just don't see what I see. What I'm doing is a very professional skill that you wouldn't understand. I could try to explain it to you, but it would just take all stream, let's just say. There's a strategy here. It's good, I promise. You see, I meant to do that because the thing is, when you crash, you actually get better at driving. You see, that's something people don't realize. When you crash your uh, jet, your, your your snow jet mobile, you get a little bit better. Hey, the one and only laughing man. How's it going? What a shocking thing to learn about my friend. All this time I thought you were an x snowmobiler. I am! Ah. Okay, so... This one I can't fuck up because I will die. Let's back it up a bit. Oops. You see what I mean? Like, there's just some things you just, just some things you can't do. Let's take a look at the controls here. Maybe there's like a key change controls. Okay. There's action, weapon, duck, dash. Oh, I don't have a dash or a duck. That's for Tomb Raider 3. Secondary, it's also Tomb Raider 3. Roll, look. I hit all these buttons, man.
You couldn't make that jump, yeah. Oh, you'd highlight, but you would... Oh, that's okay. And I believe we saved it uh, after we picked up the doggo. Yeah, we did. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. No. Oh, while pressing jump and left or right. Oh my gosh. Thank you very much. I was, because I'm using, I realize what it is. This has got a D-pad, and I've been using the, the joystick. Thank you. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm assuming I, ju I jump up there uh, in that little hole right here, and then move the blocks. It's very cold. Ah! No! Kitties, no! No! Oh my god! I have to kill two snow leopard pets? What do you mean pets? How am I supposed to pet those? Oh my gosh. This is the worst. Oh my gosh. I had to kill two endangered species. And that's not me playing the music, by the way. That's the game. I th that was the entirely the game doing that. No, it's okay, Diggs. I'll be okay. You know why? Because all I have to do is push this block over here. And look at that. Oh my gosh, the evidence is almost gone. All I have to do is put another block right here. But if I do, I'll probably die. Anyway, <laughs> we just push it under the block. They'll think that... Oh, they'll think that these blocks fell on them. Oh. And they accidentally fell onto a bunch of 5.56 five, at the same time. This was an accident. Yes! You're right. The butt scoot animation. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's hard to pull. There we go. We're going to cover up the evidence here. I don't know why these blocks are here. Like, I feel like I wouldn't have put these here as a designer, but that's just me. Because you had that cool music going and everything was kind of bumping, and now I'm, now I'm literally doing this. I have to stop, get out, and move stuff. This is what actual adventure would be like when you take, like, a cool, like, snowmobile out. You have to move the logs out of the way and go through, like, fucking trees and stuff. And yeah, the real thing's not as fun. And you definitely will get in trouble if you shoot animals. Uh, I would not recommend that. <laughs> I'm just trying to turn left. <laughs> and that's what I got to work with, man. <gasps> oh, gosh! I didn't... Alright, I gotta use the D-pad. There's no way around it. There's no way. Yeah, because the... Oh, no. I can do this. Yeah, yeah. I got this. The jank mobile. What are you talking about? This thing is amazing. I'm just really good at it.
How strong is Laura? Because she can vertical leap, like, pull two. Yeah, I know. She's pretty strong. Okay, holding up on the D-pad definitely is a game changer. Oh, that was a good jump. Almost died. Alright, this is a good point to save our game, right? Yeah. Let's save the game right here, because that was annoying, and nobody wants to do that again. Pistol 6699 has contributed 6,282 total to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. Yeah, she's an overly overt priestess of Zork, indeed. Let's see what's in this pit. Death. Wow, that looks bad. Let's not fall down there. Let's also check over here. Yep, we're going to have to do a bunch of jumps. We'll have to go up this ramp, do some sp spinny tricks, I'm sure. Oh, there's a climbing area up here. Yes, we're going to go up here. There's like a little thing in the wall. How do I get up here? Okay, when I go over here, I make a right. It's like this way. Okay, here we go. Snowmobile time. Thanks for, thanks for, yeah, no problem. We did it. Now all I have to do is pull this lever. And there we go. Apparently that is where they installed it. Like, some engineer put a lever into the wall of a cave which activates a door. Oh, apparently there's a bad guy going to shoot me. But anyway, there, it activates a door all the way over here. I'm convinced Lara Croft lives in the Minecraft universe because this is the only way that I can see this working. This is like the proto-Minecraft universe. This is what happened before the fall. Oh, oh. Ooh, did you drop any goodies for me? As I will gladly get off my bike for goodies. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. He dropped some magazines. We're also going to just shoot this guy. With our magazines, we got off his friend. All right, anyway, we're going to go pick up whatever he dropped. No, don't turn. There we go. Oh, he dropped a health pack. We definitely need those. Ogawa, Rage Toaster, Bully Snake have all contributed a huge amount of goob to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. Thank you very much, everybody. Ow. Okay, here we go. Big jump! Big jump! Big jump! Oh, no, never mind. Wait, wait, wait. What? Is oh, I thought there was going to be a cool jump there. That would have been the ideal spot. All right, we're going to go back into that cave. All right, I want to show you what I mean. There should have been a nice big jump there, but unfortunately, there was just a bunch of guys. Picking up the health pack was a good idea. Let's go take a look at what this cave's all about over here. See, I thought there was going to be like some big, giant, cool jump here, but no. Again, as I said, I'm fairly certain... We're in the Minecraft universe. Because who would build something like this? I don't know.
M. Tomzak, thank you so much for the goob donation to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. Uh, yeah, there's nothing else of interest over here so far that I can tell. Ah, here's a jump. Oh, and an area to climb. I'm glad she dismounts instead of just hops off. Yeah, let's... Can we drop down there without dying? That's the question. Let's try from over here. Yeah, it didn't hurt that much. Falling down there. Oh! Do I see a green speck in the distance? I believe that might be the doggo. We do have to climb up a sheer cliff face, but... Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, what is... What is this? There are just two grenades down here in a pit. Oh, God! Oh, God, there's so many cats! Okay, here they are. And there I am. I don't have to kill them if I can just stay out of their range. Who's endangered now, bitch? <laughs> For real. Mike, do you not have a pit for your grenades? I don't. Pet the kitties? I will if I could. There we go. Yeah. There we go. Oh my gosh, there's another one right there. I can't make that jump. I don't think I can make a jump that far, but I will have to climb back down. There's a lot of them over here, man. I feel like they planted this doggo here as a trap. Yeah, that's my that's my sweet climbing skills. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. Oh gosh, they're all coming. Ow, 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 Oh god! No, 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 no! I can do this! I can do this! Ugh! Okay, we're. Woo! Thank goodness. No idea what this is going to lead to. If it'll lead to anything. Ah, it leads to a door I can't open. Good thing cats can't climb. <laughs> yeah. Does it still count if they pet you? That's a good question. That's up to the chat. That's up to you guys. How, how do you feel about it? Do you want, Do you think them petting me counts? Oh come on. Let's go let's get on this bike. Let's get out of here. Oh my god. No <laughs> What was that? I did not save my game, but do not worry. For I now know what my mistakes were. And I will not make them again. Oh, there's some grenades laying over here. That was a wild crash. Uh -huh. I wasn't expecting anything like that. Uh, so, I should probably start saving it a little more often. This bike isn't exactly the most stable thing to drive. Uh. 
Alright, we are now back on the bike. This one's having a little shot at me, but... I just want to get off the bike. Thank you. <laughs> Every time I try to, she keeps just turning. You have to, like, time it perfectly. Uh -huh. There we go. We're going to go get that item he drops. Uh -huh. And now I have healing. And now we can just do this. Simple as pie. And the best part is we don't have to worry about getting attacked by the kitties. See, I often don't have a lot of smart ideas, but this one, I have to say, is probably my smartest idea. Oh, God, there's another. Wait, 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 wait. I was, I was kidding. I was kidding. Why? Oh my god. Okay, well, I'm saving it there. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, I, they wouldn't kill me if I had leper skin on? How am I supposed to put it on? What's the button? Oh. <laughs> I don't know what that was supposed to be. But there's like, um... Oh. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Is that a key? That's a key. My friends, I believe we may have found what we have been looking for. At long last. And then also, what is across from it? Is that like a secret area? Or is that just a hole in the wall for fun? Just idly killing endangered species again. I don't want to. Ever. But here we are. They gave me an M16 and said, well, good luck. <laughs> this sounds like the draft. <laughs> Enjoy your art show. Ah. Uh -huh. I've got, uh, here was an island art show. I can't hear the stream. Oh, no worries. Enjoy the art show, man. I'm also just going to come down here because I want to see what's in this giant pit. Uh, just cold. This would absolutely be unbearably cold to the point where you probably would die. Okay, we're just going to double check. Since we have the key now, a very important item that we definitely need. We're just going to take our time and not get murdered by some random person and murder him instead. what I thought. This dude was just waiting here. Like, yeah, go to the ice. Go to the ice cave. You know which one I'm talking about. There's ice caves all over the place. Which one are you talking about? God, I hope I picked the right ice cave. Oh, that's rude. I needed that lever. Oh. There we go. 
Yeah, he's been down there for a while, it seems. Oh, hey, we're actually in the area we were before. And that door we wanted to access that we couldn't before. Now we can. I'm not worried about those pit grenades. I'm not going to go back and get, t you know, four pit grenades. It grenades are fun, all right? But I don't have a grenade launcher. And right now I'm just collecting ammo that I think I might actually lose at some point in the game anyway. There's a grenade launcher somewhere. I picked it up, and then when they captured me, I could not... Uh, uh, I lost everything, pretty much. All right, so we can jump across that, no problem. That's just a run and jump. Pretty simple. Very straightforward. Yep. And now we can get on our motorbike after we save the game. And we have finally gotten a key. And hopefully this will open up that little shack or something. I don't know. We'll find out. Ah. Ugh. Ah. Whoa. Whoa. No. No. Okay. Okay. Yes, I can drive. Let's see. Ooh. That looks interesting. See, I didn't want to drive back here because I didn't know if there was it was just like a corner. I didn't want to get stuck. Uh what's this? Oh god. Am I supposed to drive my bike through this? Oh, that, okay, well, sure, maybe. I guess we found our own way to get down there. This is, I think this is like another way you can just jump over there and get down there, but we found our own way, so we didn't need this. The Night Hells contributed 60,000 total to the Art Goob Drive Challenge. So we got uh, down here. We got some big ass doors. Uh, frozen lake. Okay. Fine. I'll accept this. Okay, so this bridge here is down, and I need to raise it. I'm assuming it's something over here. That would make sense. Th th that would be right for this game. Wait, can I not climb up here? Oh, no. That is too steep, apparently. Let's take a look around. We got a frozen lake. Oh, and there's the key. Damn. How do you get it? This will be a perfect time for a grenade launcher. Hmm. Frozen Hawk Hunts has contributed 8,000 total to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. Thank you. How get flamethrower? Hmm, that's a good point. A flamethrower would be good there, too. Look, I just... Can I go up here, please? No. All right. Maybe I drive the... Yeah, may I have an idea. Maybe I drive the car off the ledge into the lake, making it explode? No, it doesn't seem like that works. It's too far away. And I don't think I could jump up there either. Let's find out. Oh wait, there's a there's literally a keyhole here. Is this the, is that what this key is for? No. 
No, please don't do this to me. I need that other key. Oh my gosh, it is the drawbridge key. In the middle of that lake is probably where I get the other key. Shoot the ice, shoot the glass. I, there's no, like, aiming my weapon to do so. She automatically aims. Oh, gosh. Barrels. Ah! Ah! No! No! I died. <laughs> We're like, we're so good. <laughs> we're going to turn off. We're going to open this gate. Just seems like a smart idea in case we need to use it as an escape. I get off the bike. Off. <laughs> she won't get off. <laughs> Did I at least look cool? <laughs> it wasn't barrels. I'm sorry. It was like giant snowballs or whatever. Like uh, an avalanche was happening. So my brain was my brain thought like Donkey Kong with the barrels. Like I was the first thing I came across and I was like, wait, that's not the right game. We're gonna save our game first. No, no! <laughs> Oh, Wolf999 has contributed 48,000 total to the Art Goob Drive Challenge. Thank you. Uh, uh, uh. All right, slow down, slow down. Not a race. I certainly hope that was a good noise. Okay, it looks like I can ride the wall instead of trying to jump this. Yeah. We did it. The avalanche happened. And there's our key. It's not buried under the avalanche, thank goodness. Uh -huh. Now we might have the key to the house. No, 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 Who the fuck? Where did he come from? Why didn't I hear like a distant... Where, where did this guy come from? No. <laughs> we just... Why? Why is Tibet so hard? Do, do people in Tibet have to do this? Like, every day? Yeah, you had to walk two miles uphill in the snow to go to school? Yeah, well, I live in Tibet. We have to race snowmobiles. Okay, we're going to save our game. Cause I don't know where that dude came from, but he is not going to be a problem anymore once I'm done with him. I have an idea, because he can't touch me if I do what I'm thinking of doing. Uh -huh. Ow. He's got machine guns on his! Can I have his bike? Dude! I want that bike, but now it's stuck in the wall. No, no, no. We're going to get that bike. We want that bike. That's what we're fighting for here. 
Damn it, he just runs you over. I swear to God, motorbike guy. Oh, he just runs me over. Well, that sucks. Let's do Uzis on this guy. I feel like he's earned an Uzi or two. There he is! Uh -huh. The bastard. Oh, come on. What is this guy? Is he wearing a football helmet? Why? Oh, my gosh. I'm so dead. Yes! Suck on that. Oh gosh, please let me have the bike. <gasps> I get the bike! Dude. We have a bike with machine guns on it. I never want another bike again. Now let's see if I can get across because Well it's a cool bike, I can't get across this because I can't boost. <laughs> this is gonna suck. Yeah! Oh no! <sighs> they want us to take the, the one that has speed. That could have been us. That could have been us. But no, alas, we have to, and we actually didn't pick up the key either, so it's a good thing we reloaded. Uh -huh. Drive backwards and fire the guns? Silicon, you're a, you're a genius. I'm going slower. <laughs> Yeah, it's dead. Ah, murder bike is not meant to be. I guess I'll just have to deal with having a boost. And get across chasms safely. Ugh. Now we just go back the way we came. Ow, ow, ow. Ah, ah, ah. This is why I looked. The Bionic Babe has contributed 6,000 total to the Art Goob Drive Challenge. Hello and welcome. I know what, yeah, that is a tease. Maybe we'll get one later. Maybe we'll get like one that's actually like cool. Dencon Zenith has contributed 10,000 total to the Art Goo Drive Challenge.
We're going to aim for the middle. Yeah. Oh, no. We did so well. <laughs> Oh no, I can't bring the snowmobile back up there. And there's a, there's a mountain lion or... No. Off the bike. All that work and I can't even take it with me. Okay. That's how you want to be. Just murdering animals defenselessly in in, the, in Tibet. Yeah, I'm sure Tibetan snow lion, uh, snow or uh, snow kitties are not are not endangered anyway. Al Kovac 52 has contributed 2,000 total to the April Art Goop Drive Challenge, as well as Joe Dog 39, who donated 700 or 4,761. BPL Tex, 4,000 total to the Art Group Drive Challenge, as well as Point Man Frosty 73 with their 2,000 total to the Art Group Drive Challenge. Now I just gotta open this door. And there we go. We're to bed is a place. Uh -huh. Wasteland Wanderer 1216 uh -huh. has contributed 2,000 total to the April Art Goop Drive Challenge. I'm feeling a lot better now. Uh, earlier today, I had like this massive migraine. Uh -huh. It's just, it just feels nice to have a blanket around your legs and just hang out with everybody and play a game. It's just nice. Let the goob flow. Koopy Bear has donated 6,000 total to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. And we got two guys with machine guns, three actually, trying to kill me. Which is a poor decision on their part. Because I plan on issuing all the 556 five, that they could ever want. Why are they... Wait, are they... They were sloth squat firing. Look, this guy is Slav Squat firing, man. <laughs> Slav Gunman, of course. Uh -huh. And what'd you drop, buddy? Uh -huh. Ah, good. I need a health pack. You see, Ivan, you have no fear to hit friend Boris when Boris squat like tracksuit photo from home. Hmm, good thinking. See, I don't know if I'm supposed to take a car through here, because I don't have one anymore. They took my vehicle away. Oh, and look at this. This is totally a track I need to take a car into. Alright, we're going to save the game right here, and then we're going to try it. Seeing if we can get down here and... What happens to us? Oh, oh! I hear a, I hear a bike donation. This man wants to donate his bike to me. How generous! Yeah, he's a little slippery though. Got him. Your James Bond bike. I want this. Look, I think all snowmobiles need to come standard, at least with the option to mount machine guns. 
I mean, look at that. That's just a cool idea. Trade lead for bike. I needed the bike, that's for sure. Because you got all these cool jumps and stuff. What am I supposed to do? Not ride a bike through them? Let's actually check this area for any little nooks and crannies that might be hiding secrets before we go to the next. Yeah, we're good. Oh, no. Oh, wait. Actually. Oh, yes. Hold on. No, no, no. I can do this. Yeah! We're going to get off the bike, though. Because I want to see what's down in this pit. There's a ladder here. Which usually means that there's something of interest down there. Let's climb down the ladder. The fast way. <gasps> Golden doggo! Oh, no! Oh, no! Whoa! Oh. Thank you, Prince of Persia. <laughs> no kidding. Oh my god, this gold doggo had so much Uzi ammunition. That was someone's stash. There's like eight magazines full of... Dude. Someone's going to be really upset when they find out that someone's taking their Uzi stash. Shouldn't have laid it down here, I guess. Grab. There we go. Hey, I think we got all the doggos now for this level. I think we picked them all. I'm saving my goob, goob in, te in case Tex plays... Uh, Battletech HB, uh, HSB on Twitch. I want to make him salvage a scorpion mech or battle armor. Well, don't get, don't get reveal your evil plans before he gets a chance to do it, because then he'll know. <laughs> Eat lead. My motorcycle has machine guns with infinite ammo. <laughs> yes. Let's see what's in this area. I'm also going to see if they dropped anything because I don't want to get off my bike. Nope, he didn't drop anything. And then this guy down yonder? Uh, no. One guy there and the other guy must have died in the graphics, but no, he didn't drop anything. Thank goodness. Um, Some jumps and stuff. A little wall back there with a little movable block it looks like. Solaris winter mode. Yes, I will save as well. Thank you, Quintless. And yeah, movable block. You gotta push it, looks like. First things, though, we don't want to fall. I'm so glad they let us have the mo machine guns to do all that. That that makes it much more fun. That was more fun than, you, than I realized it would be. Like, the aiming is silly... <laughs> the enemies are not really smart, but I enjoy it. All right, we made it into... Oh, gosh. A party? Look, I don't really like using the M16 that much. That's why I'm using it now. <laughs> I just, I just want to get it out of the way because it's just not a fun weapon has a, a very bad aiming system. If I move, she resets her aim. Every single time. 
Is he dead? Yes. Heal. I will actually I will heal when I take a little more damage. Does that tiny lady just push a block that must have weighed ten tons? This lady can jump like fifteen feet in the air, man. She is uh quite robust. Oh. I don't know if there's anything up here, but I just wanted to jump up here. Like a cat, you know. Just saw an area looks like I can climb. Do I go to where that guy is? No, he's just in a cave by himself. Ain't nothing there. There's a cave down. Yeah, you know what? You guys are right. I need to believe in myself. I believe. <laughs> You just, <laughs> just crunch. Well, I tried the <laughs> crunch. I don't think there's an easy way to get down here, unfortunately. Like every way that I can see to fall down here is just going to be painful. There goes my hero. <laughs> that would have been perfect. He didn't even have anything up here. Wait, what? what's back here? Why is there like a little area over here? Oh, there's nothing. It's just... And now we swan dive. I'm going to use the Uzis. I'm just getting a bad feeling. And I got so much Uzi ammo. Why do I hear noises I don't like? Let's save. I'm scared. Hypothermia. Oh. Whew. We did it. We did it. We did it. The Betten Foothills over. Confidently walking through the snow with shorts on. All right, let's see. Where does this one take us? What's this place called? Barking Monastery. He did say that there was a monastery, Barking Monastery, in the beginning. Everyone. I don't think so, dude. Uh, there was like a kung fu movie going on here, and I just showed up and started shooting everyone with an Uzi. Uh -huh. He doesn't have Uzi ammo on him. He's playing the Tomb Raider theme, but like discordant. <laughs> oh, come on, bird. That wasn't just any bird, that was a crow. Every single crow in this game so far has tried to murder me. And they take many Uzi ammos to die. Because crows are quite robust. I don't know what's over here, I'm just doing this now. 
Sometimes I just go through a path. And it looks right. There's a door here. Oh. Oh, there's like a little secret thingy over here. So if I open this door, where do I do it from down? Oh my gosh, maybe that's how I get in here. Okay, we need to be careful because we can fall easily. This is pretty high up. Every crow you dealed with is an attempted murder. Nice. They have been trying to kill me. Oh, hey, Mad Ducks. 24 months. You have now been subscribed for two years here on WBPL76. And he says, oh, hey, this thing popped up again. I don't know why it keeps popping up every month. I don't know where I am. And most importantly, I don't know what is going on, but here I remain. Castus223 has contributed 16,000 total to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. I'm just trying to find... I think I just have to find, like, a lever or something. Let's try climbing this obvious climbing area here. See if this leads anywhere. <coughs> Mad Ducks has also contributed 18,000 total to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge as well. Lord Grimos, who has donated 74,000 total to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. Thank you. Bird. Interesting. I didn't realize there were eyes up there. That's weird. It's like some sleepy eyes. I wonder what they'll mean. Huh. Uh-oh. What's down here? Death? No, just a ledge. Perfect. Ah. This is how I get over there. No. No. <laughs> That's a lot of bullets for a little bird. All right, so here's how I'm going to get over there. I am going to jump over here. And then do this and this. Yeah. I hope that I was hoping that would work. Why are we all going to the stupid things? Oh, yeah, that's true. That's true. We all type stupid things. Is that a window? Not anymore. Some books. We just shot up their public library. Okay, guys trying to kill me in here and out there. He also left some grenades out here. Uh -huh. Grenades are super useful if I ever have a grenade launcher. Do I have a key for this? <coughs> no. I just have that serif. I don't think that actually opens anything yet. Oh no. I'm scared. That's a lot of noise. Sometimes you just got to be a little bit quicker or have Uzis. Oh, they're the emotional support grenades. Oh. I don't know who's shooting me. Well, that's hot bullshit, dude. What are you supposed to be? No. Fuck. Dude, this guy had so much. Uh -huh. 
Look, I was like a mini boss. That dude took down so much of my health just trying to kill me. Shooting as you climb is cheating. Yeah, I don't know what that was. It's a smart move, though. That made me use my health packs. Oh. No, thank you. <laughs> I'm good, thank you. I'm going to take this key. But I'm going to roll. Uh -huh. The second I touch something in this room, I just know somebody's going to be like, no. You, you think it's up to no good? What do you mean? Looks fine to me. What did it look like in the original? Oh, yeah. <laughs> the differences. There's a ceiling window. No. What was that like a... What is that, like a boulder of ground beef? Where'd they get that from? Ha, <laughs> nice try. Uh -huh. These flares are mine. Where does that lead, though? Uh, some kind of long fall that I'm not prepared for. Is that a ladder, maybe? Yeah, there's a ladder here. So we can climb up here if we need to. Let's continue looking around first. <laughs> there's true, though. Where did they get a boulder of ground beef from? I want to know. Like, what's the lean ratio on it? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No 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 no. No no no. I'm okay. I'm okay. We'll get up to the surface. It's just Oh no 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 no. Oh no. This is bad. I am going to be drowning in a current. Oh my gosh. No. This is bad news. This is very bad news. Maybe I'll be okay. Ugh. No, <laughs> we're doomed. We're doomed. <laughs> no. We were doing so good. Ugh. Ugh. Yes. Yes. Oh. That was a death trap. I'm going to save a new game. <laughs> that was close. But fortunately, I'm actually pretty good at this game. I bet you haven't even seen me die yet. It's because I haven't. Oh god, I'm going to die. All right, I'm going to let go. Leap of faith. Here we go. Oh, thank goodness there was a body of water down here. There we go. I was looking for that button.
Cool. Wow, you can switch the weapons like that? Cool. Anyway, uh, let's just do this. It's a lot easier than trying to figure out what button combination it was. Also, NNT28 has donated 24,000 to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. We've now reached 3 million goob raised for this Art Drive Challenge, which has been great. Uh, what do you think this is supposed to be for? Like, what do you think this area is for in a Tibetan monastery? We did it. Oh, that's where they made the ground mound of meat. Gotcha. No. Ah! I had a hell of a hell, uh, excuse me, hell of a lot of hell. I don't like this. Uh -huh. Oh, thank goodness he had a health pack on him. This is not going to be, uh, very easy. Lady Drakard has contributed 4,000 total to the April Art Goop Drive Challenge. Thank you very much. I have a feeling that this is going to end up being bad. Why is it playing bad music? Don't. No. Uh-huh. Oh, no. What did I pick up? What is this? Prayer wheels? Interesting. Maybe I have to put something back? Doesn't seem like it. Well... <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Why is it playing bad music? I'm scared. I get scared of things like this, because then I'm like, okay, what am I... I need to prepare. Uh-oh. Oh. There we go. That wasn't too bad. I don't know what everybody was talking about. This tomb reading stuff's easy. I don't have this prayer wheel, which I'm sure is super useful for something. Right? You have to be. Why would I have taken it otherwise? I'm not a criminal. She has once again solved her problems with acrobatics. And yes, this is true. That's how she solves many problems, actually. Oh, there's like a little block right here. I uh, don't think I can... Oh, there's another block right here. I didn't even realize this was a block. It blends in so well. Unlike the original game, which I'm sure, yeah, that totally doesn't blend in. <laughs> yeah, I probably would have noticed it if uh, uh, otherwise. Yep, and then all I have to do now is just 
pull it back this way. And now I'm inside another area. Let's also just double check to make sure there's not like a... No. Okay. Like a secret little spot where you can climb up, you know. Sometimes they put those in. Actually, there is that dark corner over here. Is that hiding anything? No. Okay. Nothing there. Nothing back there. Okay. Let's, oh, we got to climb a ladder. Of course we do. I think this might actually lead to that area we were in before. Uh, that had an, a ladder where we can drop down. I think this might actually be it. And if that's the case, then we're not too far off from where we need to be. Don't know where I'm supposed to put any of these items, but I'm sure we'll find it eventually. All right, so there's our mold of, giant boulder of ground beef. Now we just got to return this way. Got him. I just had to jump at him a little bit. There we go. Health pack obtained. Uh huh. So I'm supposed to do something down there. I'm assuming like I'm supposed to put the prayer roll somewhere and then it activates another thing. I, I don't know. All I know is I feel like Laura is kind of in the wrong here. She is just killing these Tibetan monks. Well, they're not giving her a whole lot of choice, I guess. I'm just making sure, man. Oh, that's where those are coming from. Oh, that room seems like fun. Let's go inside there. What's this? Oh, that's where you put the serif, right? No. And what about the a main hall key? No, excuse you, door. <laughs> well, I like I just like these guns, okay? We'll switch to a different gun. Oh no, I've let the bad guys in. Man, we're just having to blast everybody today. Uh -huh. The sound it makes is considered a prayer. Oh, that's cool. So it's like a little thing you spin and it makes a sound. That's awesome. After that romp, we're going to need a full health pack. All right. Very cool. Yeah, let's go back to that fun room first before we explore the big giant hallway of death. That room's got spinning stuff in it, and that's always fun. These goons are ginormous, Bully Snake. Do I even have a key for that? Nope. Let's just double check, though. Yeah, it looks like it takes a keyhole. Incredible balance. Ow. Uh, those curtains are very stiff. <laughs> That's not good. Okay, that door is closed. There's, like, a couple of other big giant room areas. I think I can climb on this thing. First things first, let's check the little side areas. Uh, 
Take care, Kitty Low. How was there much murder when I was on archaeology programs and TV? Well, this is what they don't show you in archaeology class. Ah. No idea what I have to do up here, but we're going to jump on it. Like a calf. It's made of gold. Oops, I need to run and jump that. I just have to be careful because that that fire can actually kill me, I think. Okay, I'm good. Wow. Yeah, I just climb up here, that's it. Some kind of block here. The seraph? No. No. The prayer wheel? Nope, something else goes there. I wonder what it could be. A mystery. Yeah, we found the Seraph in a, that sunken ship. Oh. Oh, the prayer wheels. Oh, I see now. Yeah, I gotta find the rest of them. Looks like I'm missing three. One, two, three, four. I'm missing four. Okay, so we need to find four more prayer wheels. Now we're under the statue. That's kind of cool. What's down here? Can I walk on this and not die? Apparently so. Uh, looks like there might be a way out of... Like, this might be like an exit for something later. <coughs> Ow! Well, this game is fun. And I thank you guys for joining me. However, it is time for me to uh, say good evening for now it is uh, coming up next, I believe, is Aiden. And then when we return next week, hopefully we will be able to uh, continue our journey through this <laughs> insane Tibetan monastery. But anyway... That's it for tonight. I appreciate you guys for stopping by and hanging out with us here on WBPL76 and your contributions to the April Art Goob Drive Challenge. Thank you very much for that. But yeah. That's the end of tonight's stream. Thank you everybody for hanging out with me. Stay tuned for Item. He'll be coming up next here on WBPL76. Again, Thank you once again for everyone who's donated, everybody who subscribed and followed us, and everything that you guys do. And and as always, you all have a good night. I will see you next time here on WBPL 76. Take care, everybody. Mm -hmm.